Mum's away, the figs will play. <laughs> You're a little devil, little fixie's a little devil. Aren't you little fixie? Little fixie's a little devil. Ooh, you're a little devil child. Get it, What do you know, fix? Alright, before I go cycling, I'm gonna have a juice. A boost juice, babies. Well, actually, I'll probably just have about half of this before I go because I don't have too much. Because I want it, don't want it sloshing around inside my belly. And it's not going to be a long ride, so I'll be back for breakfast very soon. Look at this rainbow fruit bats. Meh. Where are we, Dream Rider? We are Trapdoor Alley. Trapdoor Alley. Trap we love alley. the trapdoor spiders. They're so cute. And they say hello to you and then close the door on you. Close the business. Sorry, nobody home. Maybe it's been a bit early for them. Okay, we're home from the bike ride and that was pretty hot and sweaty, definitely. It was good and a lot of people are like, why do you show your body so much freely? You know, why are you showing your abs? Because she's <laughs> lean. And people are like, can I take you back? Yeah, that's right. That's right, he's right. You know, the whole, whole I quit sugar bullshit. You know, people out there saying fruit makes you fat. Blueberries, the Insta fat, all this rubbish. I have to, you know, go against that. I have to show that that is bullshit, or else I would be obese. And as you can see, after eight years of smashing in as much fruit, carbohydrates as I care for, I'm only getting leaner. Okay, so we got this melon from down the road. Let's see how it is. Hopefully, it's a good one. I've got a few more if it's not a good one. Taste test of Jaren Rider. It's about a, about a 6 out of 10. Not about bad. 6 out of 10. We can work with that. Mm -hmm. But I wasn't expecting them to be good at all because we've got mm. the long ones. The long ones are going to be good. It's my first watermelon for uh, a long time, maybe almost a year. I don't eat watermelon in Australia because it's just so hard to get good watermelon. But it's actually pretty sweet. Watermelon in Queensland and South Australia is pretty good if you get the good stuff. It's hit and miss. It's but hit when you get miss. really good, yeah, good come good. on. I yeah. wasn't hit and miss. Okay, so now I'm eating my half a watermelon and you know what? Durian Rider is full of it because this is at least a 7.5 out of 10. Yeah, whatever. 7.5 out of 10, bro. Very crispy, sweet. Look at this. You can just tell. Look. Quality. It's a really nice watermelon. So I'm going to enjoy this watermelon. I'm going to um, answer some emails. And I'll see you soon. Someone's sleeping. Someone's taking a nap. Okay, so I've got mangoes and I'm just on the internet there. Check out all this fruit. Crazy fruit bats. Surrounded by beautiful, fresh Gold Coast fruit. We've got local watermelons, local bananas, papayas. I'm not so local, I don't think, but they're not that far away. Got some local mangoes. Be beautiful. Also got some light cheese in, in the fridge as well, which I can't wait to get into. Give me a home among the gum trees with lots of plum trees. A fig or two or a kangaroo. Clothes line out the back, veranda out the front, and an old rocking chair. Is that right, Juno? You like Australia for that reason, don't you? Yeah. Got anything to say to the fruit bats? Count the fuck up. He's right, isn't he? I think we we'll have to send him home on the plane tomorrow. So I'm just on the computer here and I'm eating blueberries. Look at these beautiful blueberries. Such a great size. They're very juicy. Figsy hates when I'm on the computer. I mean when I'm on the camera. She has to go. So I've got these blueberries and they are amazing. They're the best that I've really ever had. And look at this huge bucket. And you basically have to eat a whole bucket to get enough calories because blueberries are so low in calories. So we're about to go out to dinner and this is what I'm wearing. Got my jeggings on again. And this top, a little bit of mesh here, some black. And I did my hair a little bit differently today. Got some um, curls at the front and just straight. 
straightish at the back. So a little bit different. So we'll see you at dinner. Cavill Avenue, the most famous place on the Gold Coast, Australia. Lots of tourists. Here. Lots of very, lots of tourists. Very touristy. Especially this time of year. Now we're going to try and find a car park. I had to go vendors. Vegan cafe. Okay, so here we are at Gavinda's. Vegan restaurants. Yay! That's all we want. Plant foods. So we've got a little buffet here that they do all day. Um, oh, it looks good. Potato bake, and this is all vegan, by the way, because I already rang up and checked. There's a gluten free, vegan, veggie chunk. Oh, brown rice. Thanks. Tofu salad. Pumpkin pesto. The garden salad. Okay, so this is my first plate. I basically got one of, it, one of everything. Curry, some dal, some potato bake, pasta. What do you call these little things? Chapati? Chapati. I don't know. House of yours. Us if you one of these little things again. Mm. All right, so we're at the airport. Little Corns is gonna go home. Let's try to bike in the box. Little bike in the box. So have you had a good time? Always a good time with the chook. With the chooky. Always a good time with the little chooky. Oh. I reckon the chook should come back to Adelaide. Thumbs up this video. Fred should come back to Adelaide. <laughs> no. Or Th thumbs thumbs up this video if no. Drew and Ryan should come to the Gold Coast. Thumbs down this video if Fredly should stay on the Gold no. Coast. No. Thumbs down. Thumbs up. Come on. No. Oh, little sweet kisses. So there <laughs> we go. It's been good having you here. It's been, it's been good. good. Yeah, so we, we had a special announcement actually. A few people have written us and said, can you give us a little scholarship? Can you give 50% discount on your books? Yeah. Your e-books. And Carve it's a the new fuck year up and, and do it yourself. And, yeah, can we do it? Yes, we can. Yeah, exactly. Because I want to see all you fruit bats succeed on this lifestyle, on um, a high fruit diet, on Rotel 4. And my book is all about that. Fruit, fruit, fruit about getting lean, about feeling your best, looking your best, and that I've I've followed everything in that book to get to where I am today. Likewise. I mean, basically, we've spent, I've spent literally hundreds of thousands of dollars experimenting, you know, 20 years of my life, working out what diet and that works, the training, etc. And for what you cost for an e-book, you read in a couple of hours, you learn all my secrets, or freely secrets, in a little e-book, you can read in your iPhone on the way on the train to school or whatever. Yeah. It's pretty freaking cool. <laughs> it's going to be worthwhile, definitely for but you. But people said, we want it even cheaper. So, all right. All that <laughs> so hard like work. Two for one, all that hard work, you can have it for 50% off for 24 hours, a little yep. scholarship. That's a big discount. We're not going to do that again for a long time. It's only one day. What's the code? Take action. Take action. Take the code action. is take action. You need to put that in to get the discount. Okay, right. so make take sure you action. put that in. And, and my book, if you're wondering what it's about, it's... All my diary entries from when I first came to this lifestyle like eight years ago, all the mistakes I made. Yeah. And I've had rave reviews on it, had a lot of good reviews. So, so Freely's book is the best selling raw food book ever. Best selling raw food book ever. My book isn't hasn't reached that level yet, but hopefully in a few years. But so many copies, Freely has just I have sold a lot of copies. Yeah. Freely's basically changed the raw food movement single handedly. Made it accessible and easy to understand and not give people an eating disorder. Like, if you're going to raw food, you're a failure. Yeah. That's just not the mentality anymore. It's 24, 2015. Yeah. So, Freely and myself, real world information, real world advice. We're lean, we get to feast. Yeah, if you follow the instructions in our books, you're going to get similar results in time. A long term. You will. It's long term. It's like fitness. I didn't become this fit overnight. At fucking, I was like so unfit. It took me years of hard work. I don't know what it takes. So I can, we can relate to people. freely has been overweight, out of shape. I've been sick and out of shape. We can relate to the everyday person. We ain't going back. So there you go. And we want to help you do the same, get the same results. So. But you have to take action. Yeah. You have to take the action. We give the information and you can read it and go, yeah, it's cool. But if you don't take action on it, yeah, well, stay where you're at. Yeah, exactly. It's just not worthwhile. You got to step up. You got to carve up. You got to make it happen. And the difference. Quit the yapping. Let's wrap. Let's quit yapping. Make it happen. Yep. And let's wrap it up. But I just wanted to quickly say. We're in this position right now because we took action every hour of every fucking day. 
and you can have the same results or better results if you take action every hour, every fucking day of your life. Yeah, do it. Do it. Come on, you can do it. Take action. And don't forget to go fruit or root yourself and... Cut the fuck up, please. What are you doing? What are we doing? The we secret are. business. The secret business. This is a romantic date. Romantic. Like our last date before Harley goes home. Romantic date. <sighs> This place is scary. What's a romantic date consist of? Put the light under your face. You'll soon find out. <laughs> You'll soon find out. Spiders. Really scared this one. <laughs>